Recently, users have reported touch issues for the new Galaxy S20 Fan Edition. I am going to show a method for reproducing the problem. Let's test it. First, take this Huawei Mate 8. We are using the app Touch Tester from Sirius from the Play Store. After opening, volume rocker up, pop for the pop-up menu, then change to line mode but with the volume down and then pressing the volume up for setting this mode now we are uh, ready to start swipe up with two hands and two fingers fingers are put to the lower region of the screen then swipe up release the screen put fingers back on the screen again and swipe again simultaneously and now faster and faster nothing happens now the same thing but one finger after each other i swipe up with the right finger only but when releasing it i immediately put my left finger on the bottom of the screen and then swipe up with that and then again with the right one left one right one left one like that faster and faster as seen from the screen the touch lines are so to say parallel not crossing each other this was the original intention so the screen touch panel responded properly now let's just, let's see the same thing with the good old galaxy s7 phone same application same method swiping up with two fingers simultaneously then one after the other this way and that way now another phone motorola moto g8 power everything is the same so the result is the same again now let's check this one xiaomi redmi note 8t everything is the same so the result is the same again this is how it should be and now let's have our target phone the galaxy s20 fan edition from the software update it's seen that we have the latest version atg1 and uh, let's go to the test program we are here first two two finger swipe simultaneously one might see a few crossing lines like that so i do it fast and there might be seen some stupid lines like here which means that this was a or also here these points are the ghost touches but the story as you see also here and here but the story doesn't end here let's see one finger after each other like that and see what happens it's a problem because with these crossing lines everywhere it means that uh, the lines here are crossing so it's like uh, the touch panel cannot differentiate between the two fingers properly when i release my right finger in the upper area on the screen here and then immediately put my left finger on the screen it registers at as the same finger um, I can show you how it is it's like I swipe up and when I touch the screen here immediately it registers this click here or this swipe here as my right finger would continue immediately here so it would be like a, a sample like that and it registers my right finger as the left finger and this is not very good it is happens sometimes on the simultaneous but this one is like you see it senses it as the same finger 
Okay, I know this is a special case and a simulated case, but it happens to your everyday daily phone use too. Any cases where you use two fingers on the screen, it can happen. For example, gaming like this, or fast typing on the keyboard, or swiping on the keyboard, maybe with two hands, or pin zoom, it happens with pin zoom too, or other gestures like that. You see, it's also registering the two finger gesture very stupidly because it cannot really differentiate the fingers. Okay, so that's all for today. I hope this short video helped you to check if you have a failed unit. Because e even if Samsung stated it was fixed in the latest firmware, it was actually not. See you!